up the This is why um, no one should be allowed to use Facebook Marketplace. Damn. Yeah, I mean, there's some gas in it. Remember the time we ran out of gas on that mini bike? Yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me, bro? <laughs> is he for real? All right, let's go over this wagon real quick. Basically, this is a vintage radio flyer wagon. And then the dude we bought it from put a five horsepower Briggs and Stratton motor on it and then custom built this whole frame with like full travel suspension. Here, come here. Full travel suspension. The shock towers go all the way up here. This is all, all welded tube frame. And then check this out. The front wheels. Full suspension. This thing's nuts. The throttle's up here on the, on the wheel. You drive it like a go-kart. This is the brake, which is like a band brake over here. So that pulls that. This is like a pretty ingenious design. Honestly, like, like this is a crazy design. I, I, a header all the way down and then it goes into Harley exhaust tips. Said so he got these off of a junk Harley Davidson. Chain driven over here. So here's the side output shaft of the motor. There's the clutch. And then it goes to this sprocket, which chain drives this rear wheel. And then that's also attached to the band brake. So it's a pretty nuts design, it's really cool. We got, this is like a like a car racing steering wheel. So it's got like 60s hot rod vibes. And, uh, and then it's got like big wheels on the back, small wheels on the front, all fatties, fatty tires. So, it, you know, it looks like a Hot Wheels. Total like 60s Baja hot rod wagon. Crazy, it's crazy. Over here you can see that the, the front inner tubes are either non-existent or low. See that? Look at that. It fills it up instantly. Second you touch the brake, everything locks up and you just start skidding. Second you gun it, since it's not a posi, just that wheel spins. So the second you gun it, it wants to just hop to the right. Crazy. This thing's scalding hot, be careful. This thing is awesome. Money well spent.
Go, Lily, go! Punch it! Go, go, go! <laughs> Try to lift this on this side. There's a Shot came apart over here. As you could see. There, so lift it. Yeah. Oh, it's empty. Yeah, yes. God. You can hold it like this. See if you can balance it. I can balance it on my stomach. <laughs> this is so hard to do. Okay, well after fixing... Well, let's see, it's gonna smoke like hell right now because we dumped everything upside down. But we put the shock back together. Oh, now it's never gonna start. That's good as new. Good as new. <laughs> yeah, this thing is fun. You're not so much as good as new. You're covered in it. This thing is fun, man. <laughs> oh my god. This is the most fun thing we own. Whoo! It's hot. Yeah, that bar? Yeah. It's roast, <laughs> roasting my parts. I couldn't close my legs because I was going to touch it. Oh my god. I really gotta hand it to this thing. Money well spent. Four thousand dollars well spent. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Four thousand dollars. Four thousand dollars. 
$10,000 well spent. All right, check it out. First of all, look how clean these wheels are. That's nuts. This thing is such a little hot rod. Beautiful. So my future plan is reupholster the seat in black, like a gray, and then throw a little shift knob on the end here, like an eight ball or a four speed or something, something cool. That's about it. This thing is wild. This thing rips, man. I was going to paint it, but uh, it really doesn't need to. It looks good. It looks really good. And uh, after washing it, the wheels, the chrome's coming out. My inner tubes work perfectly. Wild, man. Freaking wild. <laughs> 